Hey guys, Shannon Morse here from Tech Thing, and today I'm doing a Nintendo Switch unboxing as well as the new Zelda game. So first off, we have the new Nintendo Switch. This costs $2.99 online. I got my handy Kershaw, of course. Let's open it and see what it looks like. I'm so excited. Today is opening day, release day, and this is awesome. Oh. Wow, it's a lot smaller than I thought it was gonna be. So cool. Okay, let's get this baby out of the actual box. So we'll start with the screen itself. It's not very heavy, it's pretty lightweight, and it looks very durable. On the top, it looks like we have a couple of volume buttons as well as a power switch. This looks like a speaker grill, headphones, and the game card goes right there. On the sides, of course, we have the docks for the two handheld controllers. And the bottom, that looks like USB-C charging, which makes me wonder if I can charge this off of a battery. And is this a kickstand? It is a kickstand. So perfect. Check that out. All right, next we have our controllers. Let's get these babies out. I went with the gray because I'm kind of a minimalist, so I like having gray for all of my entertainment devices. I think it looks good to have everything matching, so I went with gray. You guys can go with color if you feel. So there's two controllers. There's a left and a right. They have switches at the top, triggers, and of course the joysticks and the four buttons on the front, like you're used to, and a little home button. And apparently these have a very nice satisfying click when you slide them in. See how it sounds. Oh yeah, that's satisfying. Ooh, I like. All right, so we have our health warnings and things of like that. What is in this box? Ah, this is our stand. This is where your Nintendo Switch will live if you're playing it on your large TV or small TV, depending on how you so feel. Looks like we have two USB ports on the sides right here. And how do you get to your HDMI? Ah, oh, it pops out. So if I turn this around, we have another USB-C right here. It's blue, so I'm thinking that's probably 3.0. Full HDMI and AC adapter on the back. And of course, the Nintendo Switch screen will slide right in there. And this, we have our adapter for the two side controllers, the left and the right, and those just slide in. And lastly, of course, we have our cables. So we have HDMI. This looks like a nice long HDMI cable. And can't forget these little guys. Wrist wraps, so smart. And we have our power. Perfect. And that's pretty hefty power brick, I gotta say, but it looks like it'll be compatible with other devices. So I'm gonna try plugging in some batteries and see if I can charge it on the go, since sometimes I commute more than a couple of hours, and that is what everybody is saying, that it will last is just a couple of hours on battery. So that is the Nintendo Switch. Let's move on to Breath of the Wild. So exciting. I've been looking forward to this game for a long time. So satisfying. I hate plastic. I hate it so much. Okay, so here's the Nintendo Switch cartridge case with some information on the back, as usual. And there's nothing in the box except for the, except for the game cartridge, and that is it. <laughs> All you get is a little card. <laughs> I was expecting at least a piece of paper. <laughs> Come on, Nintendo. But that's cool, that's all I'm really worried about. So I am going to get my Nintendo Switch charged up and try out playing Nintendo's Zelda Breath of the Wild. And we are going to do a full review over on Tech Thing. You can find Tech Thing over at techthing.com or if you're watching this on YouTube, it is youtube.com slash techthing. If you've never been here before, we do weekly episodes about product reviews, interviews, how-tos, tutorials, and we also do lots of tech news. We love talking about tech. We've been doing this for at least a decade, even longer if you count both of our times together. But myself and my co-host Patrick Norton love what we do and we would love it if you subscribe as well. So thank you so much for watching this. This unboxing and we will have a full review next week on Thursday. Thanks, bye!